Chase and Pete Hollis Farms this morning. I guess we probably got about oh close to an hour before good daylight. We are headed down to Mississippi. Really don't have a plan. I usually have a plan, but I don't have a plan, so I'll just decide what I'm gonna do and where I'm gonna go. I'm gonna do some kind of hunting this morning, but not sure where we're gonna go see it. I'm gonna decide when I get down there. I'm still thinking. Didn't have any hog action last night. I reckon they really scooping up the acorns right now. But anyway, we headed down. All right, y'all, not just a whole lot of action this morning. Two different does and two different little ones. Pretty fun just sit there and relax, though. Comes old Pete. I tell y'all what, this quiet cat bite is working out good. Got my crossbow stuck in the saddlebag. Backpack stuck in the milk crate. Had my rifle over my back. y'all I'm headed in to put a lock on up I ain't done this in years do a little lock on stand hunting just had a vine get caught up in that adjuster that changes the speed and broke it I'm gonna try to ease on in here and get this stand put up then I guess I had to walk this bike back out. That's gonna be a fun little spot. What is that? Hey, man, Pete is freshening feeders and freshening hog traps. I had a battery go down, just swapped the battery. May have missed a hog pitch, I don't know. Had several cloudy days in a row, and I think that battery finally went down. And we gotta freshen up one more trap. Alright y'all, so here's what I 
decided to do. I had one more lock on that I wanted to put up today. I didn't want to ride the Ranger in here, but Quiet Cats broke down. So while it's kind of warm, this stand is one that I really want to hunt the rut. So and the one I put up earlier most likely will be better in the rut when it gets cold. So that's kind of the wind I'm setting up for for cold winter time, kind of west, northwest. We'll go in here and get them out of the way and it'll quiet back down and settle down. We may hunt these stands some a little earlier as long as we got the wind right and try to shoot some hogs. But I did see a big old boar hog across the road earlier when I was easing in here on the bike. So we'll get this out of the way. Hey, beat with us. You're gonna be a fun spot. Fun spot. I ain't done this in a long time. It's gonna be fun. I gotta get me one of them camera arms so I can mount this camera on my arm so we can shoot. It's pretty. y'all Pete's trying to take him a nap we just drank us an orange drink and a little bag of tater chips that's about all we've had today besides that little honey bun <clears throat> I'm gonna eat some good supper though but anyway got the quiet cat bike loaded on the back it broke the little bracket that holds your chain tensioner and the part that swaps the gears on the chain but anyway First thing I tore up on it, and it was all my fault. I shouldn't have been had it in that stuff, I guess. But anyway, had to order a part and fix that. Had a pretty good day today. Uh, got the uh, hunting for a little while, saw a few deer. Just nice to go sit back and relax in a quiet peacefulness for a little while. Uh, got two lock-ons hung. I hadn't done that in years. I bought them stands. They're probably pretty old now. They've been in the barn a while. I had those stands for my hunters at one time and I realized a lot of my customers I didn't trust them climbing those things so that's when I started using the ground blinds and <clears throat> I was getting ready to order some stuff to some lock-ons and stuff to play with and I got to looking in my corner of the barn where some of my old climbers and stuff was and I had them lock-ons so probably gonna be pretty good in pretty good shape on the lock-ons I got a couple more I want to hang I used to love to hunt like that I hunted out of a climber a lot because I moved around a lot uh, but I really like the lock-ons I really don't want to tow the climber in I might do it every once in a while but I'm not planning on doing a lot of that but Got two lock-ons hung. They'll be in some good spots, too. They'll be one of them. That last one we put up will be one of them spots during the rut. You can just sit and the deer just travel. No telling what time of the day you're in. Quiet and peaceful back there. I, I might go in there a time or two before it gets cold, real cold, but probably not. But, and the other one will be, I'll probably hunt it a little earlier. And I got a couple few more that I want to hang really I don't I really want to get back into bow hunting but I'll have to get my shoulders back in shape before I do that and play with the crossbow I got it like I said I got to get my arm for my camera so I can hang it and operate it sitting in that lock on because I won't hardly be able to fool with a tripod on that oh uh, what else do we do oh yeah we freshened up some feeders and freshened up the hog traps Hopefully we'll get a little action on that. And before everybody starts act, asking about my hunters this year, I am not, I'll repeat, not doing any hunts this year. 
just for my own reasoning. I'm not going to explain that right now, but uh, I'm not going to do any. Pretty excited for about the last 12 years. I hadn't got to hunt a lot. I probably hunted more last year than I've gotten to in a long time because we had so many cancellations and stuff. So, and I really haven't had lots of time to spend in Mississippi over the past years. And I missed that. So, that's kind of my plan. Y'all will probably get to see a lot of deer hunting this winter, but it's mostly going to be me. So, most of the time, y'all just got to see what we killed and me skinning it and all that stuff. And I appreciate y'all watching that. But uh, this year, if things go right, maybe y'all can see me whacking and stacking some deer. Get Cody to go. Cody likes it a pretty good bit, but he'd rather be playing ball and stuff most time right now. He's pretty, he likes action. He loves the hog hunting with the dogs, and we hadn't had a whole lot of time to do that. Had so much other stuff going on, but maybe we'll get to film Cody hunting a little bit. I'm trying to talk my wife into uh, going deer hunting with me, but she just really don't want to shoot a deer. Now, she'll shoot every turkey that we can get in front of her. She likes that, but for some reason, she don't care for the deer hunting. But I'm going to try to talk her into a hog hunt or something. That'd be fun to video, but anyway, that's kind of where we're at. Most of the deer hunting and all stuff y'all are going to see this year is going to be me or Brian or Jake or somebody we're filming or something. Not going to be any of my hunters. That's going to be a pretty nice winter not to have to fool with all them people. So. But anyway, I'm going to get back to the house and feed all the dogs and water them, feed the mules and horses, and I'm going to call it a day and see what my bunch is doing at the house. Anyway, if y'all like our stuff, subscribe to us, Hollis Farms. Hats, t-shirts, and stickers, hollisfarms.com. Appreciate y'all watching. Out of here.